Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. This is episode number 10 of our RTG series Ugarte to Glory. In today's video, we are going to be reviewing our first ever player in FC25 which is going to be Job Bellingham. This is from the new promo Trailblazers and as you guys know, Job has been released as an objective. So it is a free to play card. So we are going to be I have completed this guys. The day it was released, I sat for 2 hours and I sat and completed this card. It is not that hard to complete, it's very simple, we'll look at the objectives and in today's video and in any other player reviews which we're gonna be doing, we will be doing player reviews in squad battles. The reason I am gonna be doing in squad battles, you will get to know as we play the game and as we do the review in depth because this is the best way to show you guys whether the card and the stats on the card are actually good or not. If I do this in rivals, you guys will not get to know what the stats look like how the how the passing is how the speed is with the ball without the ball all of these things in squad battles literally i can just free run even if i lose it doesn't matter we'll get to know a lot about the card so this is the main reason i'm going to be doing all these player reviews um on squad battles or in squad battles uh if you guys want to see them in rivals if you guys want to see these cards actually in action make sure you guys hit the uh, follow button on twitch where i go live every day and on youtube and um, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel because we will be playing games we will be playing this is the rtg guys we will definitely be playing games and this card is going to be one of the cards in my team so make sure you guys leave a like and hit the subscribe button if you guys are interested in watching rivals games and all that stuff but yeah let us go ahead with our video for today which is going to be uh, Trailblazer Joe Bellingham. First off, we'll look at the stats and then I'll show you guys what you need to complete in order to get this free card. This is actually a free card by the way. So it's insane. So first off, 83 pace, 78 shooting, 83 passing, 85 dribbling, 77 defending and 81 physical. The stats on card for an 85 rated centre midfielder card. You can play him at cam and striker by the way. So for well, guys look at this you this alternate positions are cam and striker so for a free card you're getting the first card of trailblazer which everybody will be getting for sure i don't know how many of you guys will be doing rafinha as well but job is one card that everybody should get because the first season it is a free free card so make sure you guys utilize that and he's can he can be played at three different positions center mid cam and striker so that is a big plus as well and he has pretty decent pace i'm not gonna lie 80 acceleration and 85 spin speed is decent on a card like this and 78 shooting if you guys look at his stats he has 80 finishing 76 short par 76 long shot and then when it comes to passing he has 81 curve 88 short pass 73 crossing and then 84 long pass so these are pretty decent stats for a midfielder cam or center mid these are not bad at all so we are going to be testing out all these passing and shooting in game in just a moment but let us look at his dribbling which is his highest rated stat at the moment which is 85 he has 87 ball control 85 dribbling 84 composure with 80 agility decent stats i would say and you can use him uh, when you're using him at center mid he has good defensive stats as well like interception is 78 he has 79 stand tackle he has 83 slide tackle so i think you guys will be uh, you know happy with this card once you start playing with it and just the first game if you guys play one game with him it's not you're gonna you won't know you will not know how it's gonna be so make sure you guys play a lot of games and then judge the card that is what i will tell with any of these cards you guys will be getting and then physical 92 stamina that is the only stat that i care about i am a stamina person i don't like doing substitution because it's just i don't know whom to bring in guys fresh legs or not i don't really care but yeah and looking at the play style he has one two three four four five five play styles and one play style plus his relentless is relentless plus he has that is actually nice he has flair technical what is this a slight tackle this is pinched pass and finish shot. Yes, finish shot, which is really nice. Now I am going to be playing him at left center mid first, and then slowly take him to cam and see how he is in those two positions. Because predominantly he is a center midfielder. I feel like, or he is a midfielder. I feel like so we're gonna play him there. And for the roles, if you guys are interested in this, if you play him at center mid, you'll get box to box plus plus, and you'll get playmaker plus. And when you play him at cam, you'll get playmaker plus. 
and in striker also he gets false nine plus so he's gonna not be the typical striker if you keep that uh, role but he's gonna be good he's gonna be good so yeah since we uh, and four star weak foot and three star skill move skill move i don't really care about i don't care even if it's one star right footed player four star weak foot so pretty decent on the left foot also hopefully let us see how the card is gonna be in game guys that is all i would say with stats or stats on paper is not everything and if you guys want to know what you have to complete in order to get this card you have to get five assists with through balls you need to score 10 goals with an efl player and then efl champions player that is uh, english division 2 i think and then you have to play 10 games with four players from efl championship and you need to win six games with four players from uh, with at least four players in your starting 11 so if you complete all this you will be able to get this lovely card now this is our uh, it's not gonna be a walkout isn't it it's just gonna be there i wanted to see if it's gonna be a nice walkout but obviously not now we're gonna put him in the squad i am gonna be making a squad around him i feel like that's the best way to do it but i'll do all that and i'll meet you guys in game one eternity later okay now i have added job into our uh, team i have tried my best to get him a three three star or three thingy but i'm not able to i'm not able to find the right players and i don't have enough coins to go and buy players guys i like recently i bought uh, a new left finger ben rama he's been really good so i'm just not gonna struggle anymore to go and find a new player just to get three full cam we have two chemistry he is getting plus two in certain places as you guys can see plus two in sprint speed uh, under shooting also he gets in short power attacking position even under passing pretty much everywhere he gets plus two in in the most important places i would say because under dribbling you see ball control and dribbling also increases under passing short pass long pass curve increases under defending uh stand tackle slide tackle and defensive awareness increases with these stats if you get plus if you get full chemistry with job pretty much most of the stats will go to plus four or plus five or if you want to increase specific stats like if you think you want better shooting or better dribbling or passing you can go and apply those chemistry styles and make sure you have full chem in order to use those uh, play styles or chemistry styles not play styles those chemistry styles to its maximum effect but i am going to be using this squad i i did try and uh, bring in jack relish in order to get that one chemistry over here so i'm just going to play uh, jack relish the main highlight is going to be job guys so yeah let us go our main focus is going to be job bellingham so i need to find job somehow and get a hold of him and do my best okay I am playing squad battles and I feel like I might lose so I need to get this uh, thingy quick he has decent initial base guys I'm not gonna lie he has decent wall control also as you guys can see he has good pace he has good pace 83 pace is actually pretty decent and he's able to keep the ball at his feet very well skill move I don't really care about it he has finished shot he has finished shot so if you guys can somehow get full cam with him, it'll be nice to, you know, get your curve boosted and then use that finish shot. It'll be really nice to use him. But so far, we have played for, what, 10 minutes of in-game time. Uh, it feels good. It doesn't feel bad. For a free card, I would definitely, I mean, for me, for a free-to-play player, who, if you guys have open packs, free-to-play players who are watching, if you guys have open packs, and if you have been as lucky as me and have got nothing really, <laughs> Uh, you guys can definitely complete this card it's it, it's a plus it's even if you don't want to use him he is a free fodder card uh, and you can use the new evolution that they released along with this card because that will take him up to 86 i think from 85 and not only that he oh my god what a shot now i don't know if he'll be able to replicate these shootings in uh, rivals when your opponent is always pressing you but this is how he can shoot so the main reason I'm using squad battles to do player reviews is to show this. If I had rivals, I won't be able to show this. I won't be able to show you guys his shooting stats or his, the way he shoots, his passing ability, his pace. I won't be able to show you guys all that. I'll just be focused on winning the game and that will just get lost. This All this testing won't be possible. He has decent uh, ball control. He has really, really good ball control and dribbling. 
he has good pace for what he's given on his card he has good pace sprint speed is really good the acceleration is like 80 it's on the dot like it's 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 just perfect i am i rarely say this about ea and their uh, card ratings usually ea either give something on the card and then lower it in game or make it too overpowered in game i feel like so far shooting uh, shooting will test out a bit more dribbling and pace those two have been really good now we have not done much of testing in passing it's actually a decent pass he's able to hold on to the ball and he's able to screen like you know how players when they get the ball they should be able to screen the ball when the enemies are press uh, pressing them he's able to do that it's really nice it it's actually pretty insane to get a card our first card for free with trail blazer which is actually really nice now i have no clue why the passing in this game is still not fixed but it is frustrating the passing in this game i don't know how many console players watch me but if you guys do please leave, please do let me know if you guys also experience this or if it's only for pc because this is frustrating i pass it to job sometimes but it goes past him look at that i pass it to bruno over there why did it go to allen and why is that finish i mean why is that pass not going to him it's just weird it either goes too much to the uh, other side or it doesn't reach the mat on but so far looking at the job bellingham card 85 rated center mid it looks really good i would definitely recommend you guys use him at least for a couple of games to try him out and uh, you know shooting is really good you guys saw the goal he has good uh, pace he has good dribbling now i'll try to use him at camp but it is not going to be very different from um, his center midfield position we will put bruno at center mid and use uh, job at camp i have made the switch job is at camp he is right footed so that is that is going to help as a center attacking mid usually center attacking mid if people tend to use their right foot a lot so i don't know i at, at least according to me i usually prefer a right footed uh, camp so it is going to be he has good he has good ball control guys i did I, i don't know if i said that he has good ball control now i did lose the ball i feel like this is just a curse every time i say somebody has good ball control they end up losing the ball but he has really good ball control look at that look at that look at that look at that dribbling look at that ball control this is a really nice card i would definitely suggest you guys uh, use this because it is it, it is i am not trying to build you know build up too much hype on this card this card is worth for what amount of uh, time you're going to spend on this game to get this card not only that this card is true to the stats on paper and in game so i definitely suggest you guys try this card out with different uh, chemistry styles because you guys might have a different way of playing to me i love attacking football so i usually you know will go for higher shooting and higher pace and stuff but there are people who like passing and uh, those kind of uh, strategy a bit more he has good shot for also on him so i would definitely suggest this card for you guys and yeah hope you guys enjoy this video more player reviews are going to be on this channel because i am not the kind of person who's going to sit and play rivals or champs for that matter i can't be bothered about that but i know you guys will enjoy player reviews pack openings and a lot of other wonderful content on this channel so yeah i'll see you guys in the next one until then take care stay safe stay motivated and keep smiling guys bye bye